because you do things for the fans and so forth. How has changed you from when you started here in Las Vegas to today? Uh, the positives from where you came from, what it just kind of has meant to you to be able to do what you do now for others? Oh, when I started in, in America, nobody knows me, but uh, it's really big different now because everybody's, um, you know, <laughs> no, Manny Pacquiao. I mean, uh, really uh, uh, big changes compared uh, when, when I came here in 2001. And then just kind of the service that you do for others and how that has kind of changed you and changed the lives of other people that you help. I believe so because I'm, I'm not only uh, you know working for myself, but working for you know to help. I'm helping other people uh, to help their family and them, the way they live and to be uh, an inspiration to everybody. Uh, not only by by material things, but the way you live in this world. That be an example. That song that you had, Manny. What? In English, what's the whole gist of that song, the, the, the story behind the song that you sang? Um, the song is about, uh, you know, all of us, we have desire to help people, and that's me, and uh, I mean, that song is really uh, touching because uh, when, when we, we make that song, uh, like, I mean, the, I, you know, I mean, a uh, lonely time, we call this um, a sad time, so it's kind of, uh, that's why the, the song is about, you know, uh, it's, it's from the heart that you know, all of us, we have, we have desire to help people and we have desire to give name, give honor to our country, so that's the uh, part of the uh, meaning of the song. Manny, over here. Uh, by having your own arrival today, does that allow you to concentrate more? Are you happy not having to see Floyd today? <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy to, um, you know, to be with you guys today, um, to be the, with the press and, and the, 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 the fans who are, uh, I mean, overwhelming support of the fans. Um, I'm, I'm very surprised that a lot of people uh, Went to the meeting grade and, you know, very excited for the fight. Freddie, what about for you? Do you think it allows Manny and yourself to focus more not having to go and be in front of Floyd? Well, you know, Floyd's doing his thing, we're doing ours. Um, you know, when we're at this hotel, we're very comfortable here. Uh, this is peaceful and there's no drama. I think it's a lot better for us, yes. And then uh, from Mr. Aaron, can you clear up why you held the separate arrival here? Well, this hotel is our home hotel, uh, and uh, there was the opportunity uh, to do an event that had a Philippine flavor for the Philippine fans. You see, all the entertainment was Filipino. All the uh, performers were Filipino. The audience was mostly Filipino. I'm, an out, I'm not Filipino, although I've been around for so many years, but I'm so proud of the Filipino people and what a wonderful people they are. And Manny, as an icon of the Philippines, uh, felt, I think, very comfortable giving, this was a way to give back to the Philippine community in this town. There are 70,000 Filipinos who live in Southern Nevada all of whom are Manny Pacquiao fans. And so we were able to do this event today uh, for many Filipinos uh, who enjoyed, could meet Manny, could see Manny, and exult in being Filipino and also American. Don't worry, Bob, we will file a resolution to, uh, <laughs> to make you a Filipino citizen. <laughs> Remember, I'm a congressman, so we will file a resolution. <laughs>